How was magnet discovered? The discovery of magnetism dates back to ancient times, when people noticed that certain rocks, later called lodestones, had the ability to attract iron objects. The word, magnet, is derived from the Greek word, magnus lithos, which means, stone from magnesia, a region in Greece where magnetic stones were found. Legend has it that the discovery of magnetism was made by a Greek shepherd named Magnus. He noticed that the iron-tipped staff he used to guide his sheep was attracted to a nearby rock. The rock was a lodestone, and it was the first known magnet. The properties of magnets were studied by many ancient civilizations, including the Greeks, Romans, and Chinese. However, it was not until the 16th century that the scientific understanding of magnetism began to develop. In 1600, William Gilbert, an English physician and natural philosopher, published a book titled, De Magnet, on the magnet, which is considered to be the first systematic study of magnetism. Gilbert discovered that the Earth itself is a large magnet and that magnets have two poles, which he called, North, and South. He also discovered that a magnet could lose its magnetism if heated or struck. Over the centuries, scientists continued to study magnetism, and it has become an important field of study in physics and engineering. Today, magnets are used in a wide variety of applications, including motors, generators, MRI machines, and many others. Thanks for watching.